The death toll is now six from the string of tornadoes that struck central and southern Illinois on Sunday. This morning, the National Weather Service is reporting nearly 80 tornado touchdowns across the Midwest. One of the places slammed yesterday, the town of Washington. That's in Tazewell County. Dozens of people were treated for injuries and one person has died. ABC News Channel 20's Rebecca Thurston reports. Homes demolished, lives changed forever all in a matter of moments. A deadly tornado ripped through the town of Washington, Illinois, leaving mountains of debris and those affected with only memories. People are looking through their belongings, finding little pieces, pictures. And although the wreckage is unimaginable, only one death has been confirmed, but more than 50 with tornado-related injuries have made their way to the hospital. One brave 12-year-old describes what she saw as the terrible twister touched down. First we saw the clouds forming, and then we actually saw it coming with like the debris and stuff flying around. We heard the, it coming and the huge winds, and my ears actually popped and we could hear it draining our toilets. But it wasn't until the sirens stopped that a new reality for little Sophie began. I went outside expecting everything to be just the same. Maybe one or two trees fell over and this, everything was demolished. Most of her neighborhood is gone. Left behind is a trail of destruction. I'm from Germany and I survived the war. This looks like a war zone. This reminds me of those days in the war. It's terrible. And she hopes it won't be that way for long. Friends and neighbors from near and far immediately sprang into action. Dump trucks and excavators clearing the way for a fresh start. In Washington, Rebecca Thurston, ABC News Channel 20. Just devastating to see that aftermath. The Red Cross and National Guard have sent help for the Tazewell County community. As of last night, those seeking shelter congregated at Crossroads Methodist Church. That's just off Route 24. Head to our website, WICS.com, and click on Web Watch for a link to the Facebook page concerning recovery efforts.